we are now taking some examples and build this skill for derivatives. So let us compare first one with the formula we know fx is x to the n then f prime x will give you n x to the n minus 1. So the first one f of x is x to the 7 f prime x will be 7 x to the 7 minus 1 meaning is 6. The second one is very much known that is square root of x we know 1 over 2 square root of x. If you have any question again why it is you should check my first video the same date you have 6 3 24. Next you have f of x is x to the 7 which can be written as x to the negative 7. So then f prime x will be negative 7 x to the negative 7 minus 1. That means negative 7 x to the negative 8. Number 4 you have again power rule concept x to the 1 third is the meaning of cube root of x and then when you take the derivative of this that tells you one third x to the one third minus one so that gives you x to the one third minus one is negative two third so if you want to write positive exponent you can write one over three x to the two third next you have e to the x so the derivative of e to the x is e to the x for this one next 3 to the x that tells you f prime x equals if you remember the formula it has 3 to the x natural log of 3 yeah you are following this formula f of x is a to the x so then f prime x gives you a to the x natural log of a okay it's number six number seven now goes with the product rule because i see product of two functions so we will follow the structure we have x squared e to the x derivative of x squared is 2x and derivative of x e to the x is e to the x we just take the cross multiplication add together so in this case f prime x will give you x squared e to the x plus 2x e to the x if you want to do some simplification you can write e to the x as a common factor so then we get x squared plus 2x and we are done for this so we'll take you to the next video with little more challenging questions thank you